It's Ross Clark. It's time to look at the Bob's stuffs, all the different bits and pieces that we can do with uh, the Bob's Adventure Pack, the skins, the cosmetics, the structures, and, well, this is a brand new one, the ghillie, a new version of the ghillie. This is a different version to the ghillie you know, a desert ghillie. But there are more things with this mod. If you type in that, if you click on that, Bob's Tour Tales, you get the engrams to see what you're looking at. What's interesting is, ghillie isn't on there, on the engrams. Which makes me think, what else is there not there that we can find elsewhere, right? So, let me just have a quick look at this. Gilly, uh, flak, metal. Well, where, like, where did Gilly come from in the first place? No idea. Hang on, if we, t if we type in, what's Gilly? Uh, Gilly, uh, chess piece. Oh, it's desert, yeah, it is desert Gilly, yeah. Uh, skin, so if we just type in skin then, let's have a quick look. There we go, so there's a desert ghillie. Let's have a look at all this then. Right, what we got then? Let's have a look at these skins, man. What we got? We got the, the bowler hat. I like that. <laughs> That's just pretty good. Um, outlaw shirt, let's do that one. Outlaw pants. Oh, this that's nice. Oh, I like that. I like that. Some gloves, some boots. Oh, dude. Oh, these look pretty cool. Oh, that hat. <laughs> that hat. Which was it? Dr Drifter. It was, was it Outlaw? I think it was, yeah. Drifter, there we go. Drifter pants. Nice. Oh, God, now the Drifter hat's going to be better, isn't it? Let's, let's do the Drifter hat instead. There we go. Uh, the gloves. Drifter gloves. Fully kitted day in my cowboy gear. And if I want some dynamite. Uh, cosmetics. There you go. Yeah, place it on your C4. And uh, we do have dynamite skin. Beautiful. Nice. Dynamite. Beautiful. All right, so that's that. What else is there? There's a plant pot that we've learned how to use. Very cool thing. So you can get shovels. And it seems any shrubbery, as long as you've got an empty plant pot, you can see I've got a green one and a gray one. As long as you hit any sort of foliage, like, I don't know. Let's try this cactus. I might need to break it though on impact. Then you can place down the shrubbery wherever you want which is pretty crazy in your own plant pot right but if we just get enough uh plant parts and gun and we'll just try and break this down and gun just gotta right there we go right so one of these should be a cactus which I, I i find that pretty crazy that you can just do as many as you want there we go so now we've got cactus plants we can put anywhere we want which is super cool so you, as long as you harvest it um on and you've got a free plant pot you can then replicate that and put them anywhere any sort of foliage on the map anywhere you want can i do anything with this i don't think i can i can turn it into a different style of crap plot but i can't harvest this nah nah i can't i don't think i can harvest this for anything yeah i get nothing for it so it's just a cosmetic but it's a cool thing uh so shovels we figured out so far, any crap plot, if you hit it with a shovel, you will till you will till it. <laughs> Soil tilled to give it a growth bonus of 30%, which is cool. But we saw in the trailer, there's treasure to get. How does one know where treasure is? I haven't got a scooby doo. Maybe we will find it as time goes on. I don't like how do you find treasure? Like you can dig in random places, and if you need a bit of water. There you go. If you're having a hot, hot day, a bit of H2O to keep you going. But you can only do that in a certain range. Like, so if I do it here, it's depleted. So I need to go much further away. A thing that was in Atlas time ago. But we saw people digging up treasure in the trailer. And I would love to know how you find the treasure, right? Maybe, maybe there is maps. Maybe there is maps as a possibility. Okay, well, whilst we're waiting to figure that one out, what else was there? So that's them. You've got the frontier structures, uh, which is, yeah, so that's just a skin. So I'm guessing if we just build a, and do we need to like make, oh, so it's like one wood per one. So I'm guessing, I'm guessing we're gonna have to make like a load of these and then we'll just go, there we go. Ba bum bum and Then we'll just make a door. We'll just put a seed on, we'll just make a box. All right, there we go. Now we've got the skin. Nice. There you go, new structures. Job done. 
Looks nice. And it's got the strength of metal. <laughs> so feel pretty safe in my wooden, not wooden, gaff. Uh, so that's that wood scaffold then. Okay, so that attaches to, it has to attach to something. And it needs foundation support. I'm sh I'm guessing this is what you put your train tracks on, right? But we'll go through them piece by piece. Yeah, there's your treasure chest. So these are all your bits and pieces. Coffin, saloon chair, shootable bottle. Hang on, let's just go through them bit by bit. Shootable bottle, which, what? <laughs> is, is that it? Oh, you could change it to different sort of bottles. Tickle chicken bottle. And then what? Do you just... Can I just shoot that? And that's it. Nice. To make your own bottle shooting game. Hey, uh, we'll, we'll go through questions in a bit. We're just going to go through each bit by bit, right? Coffin, chair, swivel, tool, table. All right, what we got then? So, coffin. <laughs> Can I lay in this? It's a bed. Oh, that's amazing. <laughs> that's amazing. Yeah, there we go. We got new beds. Coffin beds, anyone? Uh, and we have, what else? Yeah, just a few chairs. A few cosmetic chairs. Like, this is like the perfect scene. Imagine if it was just white. Neo was next next to me. It would be the scene in the Matrix, right? Chairs for, for whatever season. Saloon table. Good grief. But, is the poker chair full-blown poker? No way. It, is it? It is! can play poker okay that's it getting that those gambling people well in obviously you're gonna need like more than one person to play this sit and go so how do I get chips that, that actually gave us a full-blown poker game that you can play with people but I don't know how we even begin to play this, play this on our own you can't do that these you can prop up anywhere. Can you just draw on them or what? Can't put it down for some weird... What the hell? Why has that changed? Did, did, that, did that change size or was that me? And you can just... You can draw whatever you want. Oh, you click once and then you drag and drop. Oh, dude. To make it as big as you want. Hang on then. As big as you want. That's super interesting. And then I guess, like, as anything, you can just whip out a paintbrush. And there you go. And then you just draw to your heart's content. And there we go. Hey, hey. Wooden hanging side, anyone? Which I'm guessing, I think, has the same thing. We, we saw these before. And they seem to, like, be massive. It turns... We saw these go massive. Okay, maybe not then. Um, test. Nice. Hanging signs. Somehow they get bigger. We're not sure. Uh, more dies. Th this thing, by the way, is amazing. So, I guess it seems to work with like a load of different creatures. Is it every creature? Not sure. We definitely know at least Thylers work with these. Um, there we go. Cart in. Cart on. And we're off. And these are amazing. Like, we... Earlier on, we tried taking out an oasis or uh, with these, and it looks like you can build a bunch of stuff on them. Can you play poker on the on the go? You cannot play poker on the go. Can put a foundation on there though. What? Okay, can you put turrets on there? That that's the main one, right? Can't do heavies. Can't do autos. Po like just poker on the go. That'd be amazing. You can put cannons. We we tried it earlier. Uh, so that that's that. Uh, what we got? Barrel storage, town bell, barrel storage, town bell, ballista cannon. You can put cannons on them. We, we tried that. Um, ballista. What am I going about? Barrel. There we go. So that's just standard storage with forty slots, thousand health. Can seal in five minutes. What happens if you seal it? I can hide in the in the in the box. You're joking. <laughs> oh, that's amazing. 
that's happened. Something monarchy related is happening with that then. That's cool. Can you lock people in barrels then? In that case. Send the alarm. Dude. I would need to see a raid with someone ringing that bell. So can you hide these? Please say you can. Set up trap with C4 charge. No. Oh, so. Oh, that made me jump. <laughs> that's good. Yo, that scared the crap out of me. You can't dig it though. Oh, you can. Oh, you can. Make the treasure chest go down under the desert. That's amazing, man. <laughs> it scared the crap out of me, that dude. Reveals in about 13 days and 23 hours. So that's what buried treasure is all about then. You put it down yourself and it's revealed in 13 days. So I'll see these, but nobody else will until 13 days time or 14 days time. Oh, dude, there's some, I'm seeing some potential with some of these things. Oh, well, that's lovely. Let's play some tunes to uh, this Moonlight Night. Right. Sit on upright piano. Locked. Show menu. Oh, yes. And we get to pick a song. Survival of the Fittest. Mm. Champions. Is that... Okay, we need to turn music on and go then. Oh, damn. So, that'll just... Crack on and play whatever you want. That's pretty cool. And that's me playing it, sitting on it. Gareth Coker! The, mate, the Gareth Coker meme, we can do it! Setting on yourself on fire! <laughs> With the piano! Dude, that's why they put this in. That is the Gareth Coker meme. If you've seen it, you know what I'm on about. That's brill. Duh. Yeah! <laughs> That's brill. Alright. What the hell? Oh, does that... You can set this up with a C4 trap. Yo! <laughs> what the hell? Disarm trap. And this what and this this is like a generator. This is it, it puts water around the place, right? But I'm I'm assuming if I get it near water, it will pull the irrigation across, right? Oh, that's pretty cool. Um no, that's what what the hell is this thing called? What's it called again? A windmill. Reduces fuel consumption and heat damage of nearby gas generators. Ah, so it's just the, um, another version of the other windmill. And then, that, sorry, there's, there's your water reservoir. I was getting confused. There's your water reservoir. Perfect. And we'll need to be in range of water to move water like any water reservoir. That's a big, big old water reservoir, isn't it? Look at that. The size of that. Right. Train tracks, people. Let's do this. Curious. How do these work? Let's put you there. How the hell does these snap together? That is... That doesn't work. No snap points. This is wild, dude. Okay, maybe maybe I need to just... If I put, like, another, another train track down then. So let's, like, put one here, for instance. But, which is going to be a bit of a problem. Let's put that... Let's put it here. And then let's make a connector. So. Out of range. No. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. Needs foundation support. Dude. No way. And then if I go... Hang on. Okay, then I'm going to need some uh, fence, what are they called? Um, the, the supports in it. So let's get some of the supports. Uh, what are they called now? 
What were these things called? Uh, scaffold, not supports. And then can we just can we put these underneath? Will that will that, will that work? No. Can you put? Can I put a pillar there instead? Uh, let's go with Adobe because Adobe looks cool. I can. Let's keep it moving. Oh mate. Oh, that is cool. All right, do you know what? Screw it. Let's get a train on. Add a train. There we go. E to add train. Train placement obstructed. Maybe I'm in the way of it. Oh, my God. That's amazing. Yo, and gun. Let's make it go the other way. Can you not specify what side you want to put it on? Add a train. All right, let's go the other side then. Right, there we go. And then we're going to need to put some fuel in it, which is apparently charcoal. Oh, that's good. Never. Can you breed trains? It's definitely a question. This is pretty impressive. Oh, and I can sit in the train whilst it's on the move. I, 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 should we add a cart on the move? Done it! Oh, <laughs> this is pretty good! Okay, can I get it to move backwards now? Can we add another cart? Go to cart! I can teleport to each cart! Dude. You can't drive it off the tracks. Can you put a turret on it? Damn it. Is that connected to that, or I don't think that's connected to that, is it? Can we can we like snap walls to it, maybe? So, oh, you can, amazing. To make your own carriages, dude. And yes, I saw it in the artwork, so I know it can be done. You can transport your cargo. In vaults. Can you play poker on the move? <laughs> you can play poker on the move. Let's go. <laughs> can we? Do we have to add it? Go to cart. Detach car. Can you detach on the move? Detach car. Oh, dude, the terrain has left me. <laughs> There's definitely some cool um, ideas I can see from trains. It is really good. I think if this, 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 I think if this was ten dollars, easy, easy win with the Oasis saw on top. Um, but yeah, thirty dollars, it's a bit of a difficult one. But you know, it's ten dollars per pack. I, I, yeah, I'd have been happy with this, and I'm happy with it viewing it as a ten dollar purchase even though it's not you know you know what i mean but it kind of is i like this train tracks are cool the creep the, the items are cool and that's all of the features i believe we get with this so um you know now you know if you want to go check about yourself go and knock yourself out go purchase it train tracks done